What's going on everyone, Matesh here with MTech and today we are getting back to doing something that I love and that is making tutorials and specifically it's a tutorial that I did before that I'm going to redo because things have changed. So this is talking about the Google Home Mini and talking about the Bluetooth settings with it and not just the Google Home Mini, it can work to any, with any Google Homes that you may have but specifically we're going to talk about how to use whatever Google Home you have as a Bluetooth speaker and secondly how to connect your Google Home to a Bluetooth speaker, for example, if you have a Google Home Mini and you want to connect it to a more powerful Bluetooth speaker, you can do that too. So, you know, without further ado, let's just get into it. All right, so the first thing is using the Google Home as a Bluetooth speaker, and this is the easiest thing you can do because all you have to do is just ask Google to turn on Bluetooth. So you can just say, turn on Bluetooth. All right, looking for paired devices. All right, to connect, open Bluetooth settings and look for the device called Office Speaker. So yeah, all you have to do is just do exactly what it says. Just go to your phone, go to your Bluetooth settings, and then just look for the device that's called Office Speaker or whatever your speaker is called. And then just hit that pair button. And there you go, now it's paired up. So let's go ahead and play something so you guys can see that it is paired up. Uh, I'll just go to the YouTube app and just play whatever's in my sub box. All right, it is Sarah yeah, Dietschy. Oh, it's a live direct, stream, so there you go. Like it is synced up. And you can still control the volume from here, and you can also uh, play and pause if you just hold down the side buttons, which if you guys didn't know you could do that. So yeah, there you go, it works. You can use your Google Home as a Bluetooth speaker if you have a nice one, if you have one of the larger ones, or even if you have the Google Home Mini, if you just want a little bit better sound than what your phone can give you, it works for that too. All right, next up, let's talk about how to connect your Google Home to a Bluetooth speaker in case, like me, all you have is a Google Home Mini, which, you know, has okay sound, but it's not as good as this speaker right here. So what we're going to do for this is to go to your phone, go to the Google Home app that you should have installed if you haven't already. I mean, if you have a Google Home, you should have the Google Home app. But yeah, go inside of it, find the speaker that you're interested in, in my case, the Office speaker, click on it, then you'll get to this menu, and then you'll hit that little uh, gear icon at the top right, and that'll take you to the device settings. And here, what we're looking for is the default music speaker setting. Previously, it used to be the paired Bluetooth devices, but here it's a default music setting. And then at the very top, you'll see pair Bluetooth speaker. So just tap that button, turn on your Bluetooth speaker, put it in pairing mode. Power on, Bluetooth mode. <laughs> the voice is so creepy. Pairing. But it's in pairing mode, and then there you go. It shows up, the Travel Lab HD77. I tap on it, and it will hopefully connect. I've actually had a couple issues with this. This is like my fifth time shooting this video. Connected. But there we go, it's connected. So now all you have to do is just ask Google to play some music, and it will play through the Google, or play through the Bluetooth speaker. So when I say, play I'm a Mess by BB Rexa, this song has been stuck in my head today. I'm a mess by BB Rexa. Sure. Playing on Google Play Music. Ah, hopefully. Yes. There you go. Playing out of this thing. You guys can hear that. Very loud. And you can you can control the music using this thing, or you can still control it using this. If I hold it down, it'll turn back on. You can also control the volume from here or from here both work just as well so yeah there you guys have it if you guys have a better bluetooth speaker than your google home this is how you connect to it but with that that's pretty much all i have for you guys in this one if you guys enjoyed this one or if it helped you out in any way be sure to hit that like button and i will definitely be doing more google home tutorials because i realized that with the new app a lot of things have gotten moved around so if you guys are looking forward to those make sure you guys are subscribed and have notifications turned on so you don't miss them but with that i will catch you guys in the next one bye